Now, do you see the? These are the number of verses in the Quran. <laughs> this window you are seeing, there are a number of verses in the Quran, right? Six thousand two hundred and thirty-six verses, right? Now, what I want you to see here now is this. Let me see what I can do here. Six thousand two hundred and thirty six verses. Now, the first time the word the Quran, the Quran, uh, the first time Al Quran is mentioned in the Quran when you open Surah Al Fatiha and you are going into the Quran, the first time the word Al Quran is mentioned in the Quran is in Quran chapter 2, verse 185. Right? So that is the first time. First time the Quran is mentioned in the Quran, chapter 2, verse 185. And then the last time the word Quran is mentioned in the Quran is in Quran, chapter 84, verse 21. That's the last time. The Quran is mentioned. <laughs> now, I'm going to prove that point to you on the screen here. It is very, very interesting. Something I found very interesting to share. Right? So I'm going to put it here. 84 verse 21. That is the last time the word the Quran was mentioned. Is the mention in the Quran. So here it says, And when the Quran is being read to them, they do not what? prostrate or make obeisance right to show to show a sign of respect or uh, submission right that is obeisance right okay as we saw it happen in the uh, in the instance of surah al jumma chapter 62 verse 11 it happened similarly they were standing but they refused to do anything and they left for their business now that's the last time the quran is mentioned in the the word the Quran, Al Quran, is mentioned in the Quran. That is the last chapter. Then the first chapter it is mentioned in, is in Quran chapter two verse one hundred and eighty five. That is the first time the word Al Quran is mentioned. It says the month of Ramadan is that in which what the Quran. This is we see here Al Quran. In Arabic here you see it here. Sharu Ramadan al lazi unzil fihi al Quran hudan lil nas. So that is the first time it's mentioned in the Quran, in Quran chapter 2, verse 185, right? Then again, that is chapter 2, verse 185. And then the last time it's mentioned is in Quran chapter what? 84, verse 21. So now the interesting part I want to show you is, if you write 84, 21 like this, just write it like this, 84, 21. Then you write minus eighty four to eighty one minus what two one eight five because we found the first time the word Quran the Al Quran is mentioned in the Quran is in Quran chapter two verse one eighty five so let's let me put the dot here I put the columns so that is dash dash you see it the dot dot that is in the chapter you find the word Al Quran. And then in chapter 84, verse 21, like this, you find the last verse, you find the word Al-Quran in the Quran. These two num uh, above numbers, up and down. So now I take the columns out. Uh, I, take the, I take them out. Now we are going to do uh, subtraction. So what happens is, if you minus the... Uh, 8,421 uh, 8, uh, minus 2185, what you get is, if you minus it, what you are going to get, let me, you are going to get 6,236. When you minus it, you get 6,236. 236 and that is the number of verses in the Quran
you get 6,236 verses in the Quran. Right? So whoever has a calculator next to him, you can try it and see. 84,21 minus 21,85. Just minus it and see what, what number comes. If you have the great Quran with you, uh, if you have my PDF version of the Quran, you have the great Quran with you, you can count the verses for yourself. You have a PDF, just search the number of verses, you will see it. Right? It is 6,236 verses in the Quran. I find this very, very interesting. It, is, it struck me when I saw it, right? Uh -huh. The first time you see the Al Quran mentioned in the Quran is chapter 2, verse 185. The last time you see it mentioned in the Quran is chapter 84, verse 21. And when you minus, you get 6,236 verses exactly, precisely. Right? It is an amazing, uh, you know, thing to find. It's very, very interesting. It's mind-boggling at the same time.